how sweep it is. The Braves batter and bruise. The Boston pitching staff, Oprah Winfrey them to death with the home run ball. You get a homer, you get a homer, you get a homer. And frankly, you got to be bleeping me with this offense. And this stat I'm about to give you, uh, Adam Duvall and Marcelo Zuna are the first set of teammates to have back-to-back -back games where each of them had three homers. Um, Adam Duvall watched Marcelo Ozuna do it yesterday and said, huh, that looks fun. I'll do it too with uh, two two run homers and a solo shot. And we needed them all as Robbie Erland struggled again. But I got to give him credit. He was able to kind of limit the damage. And then the second and third, he was able to have clean in him. So kind of kept us in the ball game, even though it was a struggle for him. Um, but in the second down, 3 nothing. That's like a 0-0 lead right now um, for for the Braves offense. A leadoff double by Austin Riley, who extended his hitting streak to seven games, continues his hot, hot hitting. It's just on fire right now. And then um, Adam Duvall with his first homer, uh, pulled his hands in right over the monster, broke another window um, for a two-run shot there. And then um, a single by Freddie Freeman. Extended his hitting streak to 17 games. Um, just, just so many stats, so many fun, fun stats. And then Marcelo Zuna with a squeaker up the middle for an RBI single, beat the ship there. So it's three to three. And then in the fourth, unfortunately, Robbie gave up a meatball homer to Jackie Bradley Jr. for a solo shot, four to three. And then we tried to push him to uh, the third time through the order, um, and he gave up back to back. Singles to Devers and Verdugo, but we brought in Darren O'Day, who got a line out to start. J.D. Martinez got a, a little flare single, not even a bad pitch, just bad luck for an RBI there. So it's five to three, but he clutched up and got two key strikeouts of Chavis and uh, Ploiecki to strand those runners and limit the damage there. And then the offense went back to work in the sixth and our a leadoff single by Travis Darno, a tweener right between Bogarts and Devers, smashed it, and then uh, Adam Duvall hit it high, watch it fly, got it in the air to left field, a squeaker over the monster this time, but they all count the same, tied it uh, at five, and then Matzik did a nice job um, pitching around a leadoff walk and MLB replays because we definitely had uh, Jackie Bradley nabbed on the stolen base attempt, but he had to bow up and strike out Verdugo. He was able to do that on a nasty breaking ball, keep it tied. And then Mar Marcelo Zuna, who said, I haven't hit a homer in a while. I'm going to do it again. Got a hanging cutter and absolutely crushed it. Broke another window in the parking lot um, for so uh, a leadoff uh, solo jack there, or a go ahead solo jack there. And then in the uh, bottom of the seventh, he, um, Matzik came out again, struck out the lefty Devers, and then Shane Green came in, two quick ground ball outs on three pitches. And then in the uh, eighth inning, um, Adam Duvall, just the cherry on top, a center field blast, 403 feet just for the insurance run, solo jack there, and Chris Martin, one, two, three. A uh, couple of strikeouts, and Mark Melanson struck out the side. Nasty cutters, nasty breaking balls equals a sweep. That was so, so, so much fun. Oh, I have one request, though. Make sure you put the bats in the oven so they'll stay hot as we have a day off tomorrow. But as always, go Braves. That was so much fun.